Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to install three amazing graphics mods together in GTA 5, Natural Vision Evolved, Quant V, and Chromatics. These mods will completely transform the look of your game, making it ultra-realistic, with stunning lighting, textures, and effects. Don't worry if you're new to modding, I'll guide you step by step, making it super easy to follow along. By the end of this tutorial, your GTA 5 will look like a next-gen game. So, grab your coffee, sit back, and let's get started. Before we start installing these graphics mods, it's very important that your GTA 5 game is completely clean, with no other mods or leftover graphic files. This will help avoid game crashes, glitches, or conflicts. Now, the first step is to prepare your GTA 5 for modding by installing some basic essential files. You'll need script hook v script hook v.net and a proper game config file to prevent crashes. If you haven't installed these before, don't worry, I've added all the download links in the video description. Just download them, extract the files, and then follow along with me as I show you exactly where to place them. Great! Now that you've installed all the basic essential mods, your GTA 5 is ready for advanced graphics mods. So, let's move on to the main part. The first graphics mod we're going to install is Natural Vision Evolved, also known as NVE. This mod completely overhauls the game's visuals, with realistic lighting, improved weather, better textures, and cinematic effects. I'll guide you step by step on how to install it safely without any issues. So, Let's jump right into the NVE installation process. After successfully installing NVE, we need to do a quick but very important step. Go to your GTA 5 mods folder then navigate to Update, Update, Dodger PF, Common, Data. Here, you'll find a file called dlclist.xml. Make sure to create a backup of this file before making any changes. Now go back to your GTA 5 main directory. Then open Mods, Update, X64, DLC Packs. Inside this folder, you'll see multiple mod folders. Select all of them and copy them into a new empty backup folder somewhere safe. Now go ahead and open OpenIV. Inside OpenIV, delete the entire mods folder. Yes, this step is necessary to ensure a clean install for chromatics and to avoid any conflicts with previously installed files. Once that's done, we're finally ready to install the chromatics graphics mod. Now that we've prepared everything, it's time to install the chromatics mod. This mod enhances the overall color grading, lighting, and post-processing effects to give your GTA 5 a truly cinematic look. To install it perfectly, you need to follow my steps very carefully. I'll show you exactly where to place the files so you don't face any crashes or visual glitches. Let's begin the chromatics installation process.
Now it's time to install the Quant V Graphics mod, one of the most powerful visual mods for GTA 5. I'm going to show you exactly how to install it, step by step, so please follow my instructions carefully to avoid any glitches, crashes, or visual bugs. Let's begin the Quant V installation process and take your game's visuals to the next level. Now, let's go back to the backup folder we created earlier, the one where we copied all the folders from inside the DLC packs folder. It's time to move those files back. Select all the folders, then go to your GTA 5 game location and open the following path mods, update, x64, DLC packs. Now paste all the copied folders here. If your system asks to replace or skip any files, simply click skip these files to avoid overwriting anything important. Once that's done, open Open IV again. Inside Open IV, go to Mods, Update RPF, Common, Data. Here, we need to edit the dlclist.xml file to register our mods. So click Edit Mode, Open dlclist.xml and follow me carefully for the next steps. Now, go to the folder where you earlier saved the backup copy of the DLC list XML file. Open that file, we'll use it as a reference, and copy all the file's name with NVE as I did. Now, back in OpenIV, inside the DLC list.xml file you just opened, passed it in the end of the line as I did. So make sure to follow me step by step as we edit this file to make all our installed mods work properly. Let's continue.
All right, now that we've completed all the mod installations, there's just one final step left. To avoid crashes and make your game stable, you need to install the correct game config file that matches your GTA 5 game version. You can find different versions of game config in the video description below. Just choose the one that matches your version and install it the same way I showed earlier. And that's it. You're done. Your GTA 5 should now look absolutely stunning with NVE plus Quant V plus Chromaty X installed together. If this video helped you, please consider supporting me. It really motivates me to bring you more amazing graphic content. I truly need your help to keep going. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.